congratulations you achieved all india for the tour rank thank you sir so this is your first attempt you are giving gate exam yes sir this was my first attempt okay 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 fine fine so when you started your preparation in sir, which I year sir sta started in uh, 2021 december okay 2021 december okay fine so i mean now you are currently working in somewhere or you dedicated your time only to for the preparation sir i was i am in fourth year currently so i was not working anyway oh excellent 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 okay 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 so you are still in fourth year and you achieved all india for the to rank so that is really remarkable and um, okay so fine you started preparation in the december 2021 so it means uh, what is important for everyone to understand is early preparation is obviously gives an edge right you started early right so it means you started preparation in the third year or second year ending third year uh, ending third year ending okay 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 so that is really good uh, okay ashish sir so how is like uh, made easy test series help for you the uh, made easy test series was really nice the questions were of uh, good quality and uh, the uh, what i liked in the test series is that for every question there were good amount of analytics like uh, the question difficulty level how many percent people got it right i mean accuracy of that question that really helped uh, me during my test series i uh, when after test series i used to sit for analyzing how my test went i used to these, uh, see all these analytics and uh, know if i did more uh, silly mistakes or not like if uh, a question was uh, really difficult and i did mistake so uh, there was no problem no big problem in that but if a question was easy and i did mistake that means uh, there was some silly mistake so i mm. used to see where my mistake happened and uh, also used to see the solution mm. okay okay see i mean really it is important uh, to understand and analyze your test series uh, okay so you said like if easy mistake is uh, happened easy question you did mistake uh, so you analyzed okay where was the mistake okay yes sir. so what is the strategy you follow, followed in the test series sir i uh, experimented with different types of strategies like uh, in the first initial one or two tests i did not even have the patience to sit for 3 hours i used to complete within one or one and half hour and then uh, uh, i used to feel frustrated like of thing like i did not solve so many questions for uh, such a long time before that so test series helped me to get that patience to solve the questions for uh, so much time and uh, keep my concentration for 3 hours and then i uh, there were so many types of questions like mcq msq and nat questions so i yeah. experimented with how to solve these questions like uh, if you have if i had to solve in one go or uh, if i had to do two or three scans of the paper and uh, what i found is that uh, um, the strategy which worked for, for me was that i first in the first uh, scan i uh, solved all the easy questions and uh, the questions which were uh, looking like direct mm -hmm. like uh, they were solvable in 2 minutes and mm -hmm. then uh, in the second uh, second scan i solved all uh, some lengthy questions like the question was big but uh, uh, the question was uh, to the point and mm -hmm. in the uh, and in the last i kept the msqs because they they required high thinking skills and uh, one msq was almost equal to four questions because all four options can be correct or wrong so uh, msqs need some more time and thinking skills so i solved msqs at the last okay okay nice nice so i mean uh, really i mean you followed good strategy even i say the same to uh, same uh, tips to the students uh, easy and uh, okay moderate questions definitely you have to solve with high accuracy and uh, later you can go for any lengthy questions or tough questions that's the different case okay fine so what are the source of uh, your uh, study material in your preparation i uh, studied only from my notes during the revision i did not follow any other study material and uh, i prepared a detailed long notes and uh, i studied from it and about the short notes i did not make any short notes because i did not have enough time but uh, i feel that 
if uh, someone is having time they should really make short notes because it will be helpful in the last 15 or 20 days okay so when you have taken a decision uh, of uh, giving the gate exam and the why why you thought of giving the gate exam reason sir sir i al already had some plans to give gate after coming to college but i was not sure then uh, once uh, my senior from my college got a very good gate rank and i watched his uh, interview session so i felt like okay i can go for gate and uh, i always wanted to do masters so for doing masters from a good college i needed to give gate and uh, unfortunately i could not uh, take the decision before uh, 2022 gate forms were closed so i could not attempt 2022 gate and uh, I decided to give gate in the December 2021. By that time, forms were closed. So I started preparation for 2023. Okay. So do you have any uh, placement in your college? Placements are there? Yes, sir. Placements were happening in my college and uh, I attempted placements for one or two companies. And uh, from one company, I got uh, rejected in the uh, online assessment and from other I got rejected in the interview and then I decided not to attempt for placements anymore because uh, my focus was on gate. So I, after that, I did not sit for any placements and focused on gate. Okay. So the reason I'm asking is generally like uh, students are, uh, some students, especially preparing some placements. Uh, okay. So that is also important thing. Uh, okay. So what to prepare and what to, what to take a decision. So, because, I mean, if you get a very high placement in the college, then that is really good. But if you get any small company, so I always advise and suggest students, so go for uh, the gate exam. Because, like, uh, if you start your career, okay, with a small company, and uh, after one year or two years experience, if you realize that, okay, your job is not uh, that much great, and it is coming back to the gate preparation is very difficult, very difficult. So after two years experience, three years experience and uh, leaving the job and coming back to this. Uh, and that is also obviously a risk for a risk factor is also involved, right? So you have pressure from family and other things. So always, uh, okay, you take a risk in the initial days of your career. Okay, that is obviously sizable. And the early start is one of the very good advice. Okay, because you started uh, early preparation. Okay, so that is... Sir, really I think uh, I started uh, somewhat late. I would suggest the students to start in their second year or uh, uh, like they should give preparation uh, time for one and a half year or two years if they are having college because uh, with the college th things can become very hectic. Like I struggled a lot because uh, I was having only one year and with the college uh, two semesters I gave and then projects, uh, quizzes, classes, everything just overwhelmed me. So it would have been fine if i started preparation much earlier but uh, i gave my all the uh, gave my best to this one year that's why i was able to crack this exam so fine fine okay dear students ashish is advising uh, okay to start very early and is suggesting to prepare uh, start preparation in the okay second year itself so because like uh, one more thing is also there if you start preparation in the second year ending so this uh, gate syllabus, uh, obviously some subjects will definitely match, okay, in your semester. So that will be used for semester also, right? Okay. So Ashish, like, uh, what is your future plans? You are planning for M Tech or any uh, PSUs? What is but your I'm, plan? uh, planning for M Tech? Planning for M Tech. Okay, very nice, very nice. Sir. So congratulations, Ashish. Okay, right? Okay, for your time. Thank you, sir. And uh, enjoy your success. And uh, many congratulations to your parents also, right? So you, again, uh, you are inspiration because you achieved in the fourth year itself and you started early preparation and uh, you followed the proper strategy in the test series. Uh, okay, that is very important uh, because uh, students, uh, sometimes what happens is they, they give the test series, uh, okay, just like that. They, might, they will not do the analysis. Uh, so what is more important is analysis is very important after giving the test. Uh, so where is your mistakes and how many marks you got negative? Okay, analyzing your test series, that is very important. Uh, Sir, I want to add one point. Yes, yes, please. Uh, uh, you can do everything right, uh, like uh, from uh, preparation, uh, notes, uh, test series. But if you panic in the real three hours, that all will go waste. 
so keep confidence in yourself last one month will be really difficult to handle the pressure you will feel like uh, you are forgetting everything you did not do anything you will see people have prepared more than you <clears throat> but still keep confidence in yourself you have prepared for one year one and a half year that will not go waste and keep your emotions in control during the exam don't uh, go for a question if it is taking long time just leave it and go for other questions and uh, follow the uh, strategy that you have made exactly in the exam don't deviate from it that will really help in uh, uh, making the best of the of your preparation very nice very nice very nice sir. so very nice to hear all these words from ashish so thank you ashish like uh, okay you have given uh, very good advice hopefully this will be helpful for the students okay future aspirants right so all the best for the future endeavors okay take care bye bye thank you sir take care